Uh, hello everyone, uh, I, I want to make a tutorial because I think this speedrun is a really beginner friendly speedrun for any speedrunner that, uh, that never played the game or that actually want to play the game or um, I don't know if you just want to get into speedrun and you want a not too long not too short speedrun I think this is a perfect speedrun for it like like me um, my I, I, I speedrun like Portal 2 before but I had like pretty much no experience in speedrunning uh, Minecraft was not like a good speedrun for me. I, I think there's people that like it, and I, I think this one is pretty beginner friendly. There's no like big tricks you need to learn, and yeah, there's some tricks, but most of them are pretty friendly. So, so yeah. First thing first, what you want to do when you start with the speedrun is um, first is you have the option to put it in full screen. Do it. Um, uh, you don't want to touch you want to put like everything in low to get like the most um the most um like well the most fps right and a uh, dialogue you want it to have a little bit higher than everything else because uh you're gonna like get um you're gonna play with the dialogue queue so like yeah uh second uh, you can play on controller or on, on keyboard. If you play on keyboard, I I recommend you bind um you binding binding um hmm. where is it a oh, map. Wait, where the fuck is this? A uh, map, uh, I guess it is not there. Oh, it's right there, map. Okay, so you want to bind map to a key that is closer to, that is accessible easier for you. Mine is Alt. Some people, uh, they like to stay on M. M is the base key. Um, I don't like it, so I, I went to R. And I think the other thing you want to do is have con uh, be comfort comfortable with your four spells. So one, two, three, four. If you want to change the key bind, you can as well. I'm oh, sorry. And uh, you also want um, to bind skip dialogue to mouse wheel. Uh, unless you want just to click, but it's way faster to just scroll wheel through the dialogue so yeah if you're on console i guess just click pass right okay so this is for the binding now we we will talk about the um, uh, live split so live split uh you can use most people use live split you also need the recording software if you want to have a run if you just want to have fun you don't have to be uh record your run but if you want to be on the leaderboard you're gonna have to record your run and uh live split is a good option right um and you can get uh the auto splitter it's gonna remove all um all the um, the load uh loading so that's really good uh also um Also, you want to like configure it uh, however you like, but you can also join the Discord in the description to um, get all the resource for it and help for setting up a live split and also um, knowing how to use it. So, because I use the auto splitter, I'm gonna just remove it from the screen. Um, I just leave it there. I don't have to use any keybind. So yeah. Uh, now, the first thing you want to do is create a character. So you want to go and do start character, and you want to choose a male. Okay, why a male? Because 
In this speed run, you want to spawn as Hufflepuff. In Hufflepuff, they spawn downstairs when they're male. If they're female, they spawn upstairs. So you want to choose any male. Uh, you can quit your character if you want because it's, this timer starts only when you you click uh, start your journey, right? So usually I use preset characters. So I never use this one. So I'll use this one. Um, I'll play story. We play story. Uh, you put any name you want. And once once you you're ready, you click start journey. Okay. Before you start journey, uh, you have a lot of skip cut scene to do. Okay, so you gotta be quick. So just be ready to skip the first cutscene. So there you go. I skip the first cutscene. I skip the second one, and I skip the third one. Once you skip the third, uh, the three first cutscene, you wanna start spamming G. Uh, G is the key for your healing potion. Whatever your key is for healing potion, you wanna start spamming it. Okay, so it's gonna give you a welding potion, and then you're gonna have to press the key bind to drink the potion. So for me, it's G. What happened? Are you just wait? You listen to them. I can't believe he did it. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage midair. Typical dragon would never... Professor? Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. You can look around, but it's not necessary. Because it doesn't, like, skip up uh, the cutscene. I'm enchanted to bring whoever captured it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. Yeah. Now you need to get ready to go forward, so you press your, your key to go forward, okay? And you... So you want to follow the the little, like, line here where there's water. So this line. You want to be a little bit to the left of the line to get a good entry into the cutscene. And so your character doesn't have to move around. Because if you enter too much to the right, too much to the left, your character is going to do like a spinning travel. thing just to go straight in a straight line during the cutscene. So now you wait and the speedrun is going to start right at, like really start right there. So that's where you're going to get your, your first big save of time, right? And now George died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me. I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path. So there, you're gonna start running. You you wanna hold your sh your running key, and you wanna start rolling. You you wanna start dodging. So spam your dodge key. Okay. Be careful to dodge the the pot because the pot and go on the right side of the rock. Because Miriam it's easier to go up on the right side of, of the rock. Then you keep rolling. Yes. And a here you don't want to go too fast. Because if you go too fast, um, to he's going to get stuck here. So you just want to wait. There is good. You can, you can go. But you can go and wait in front of the door. Well, not the door, but the this, this thing. Okay? You want to be as close as possible. This way. this way. I love how you say uh, this way every time. But sir, so once you're here, searching for evidence of lost magic. <laughs> Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good. Once you're here, you, you wait for him to go no down. Than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. I was gonna tell you a line. They do not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that one word. And then like start spamming your start spamming your shoot key. Then start spamming your roll key to get into the, the slide. And now get ready to press space to skip this this thing. Now you want to release your WP because you're going to have an invisible wall if you, you keep running forward, okay? 
Anyway, it's not gonna speed up anything, so you can just let go of the W key and start rolling away. Now you wanna wait here until he says he comes to your left. Okay, he's gonna come to your left and you're gonna jump. Up there. There you go. He's coming. When he's come, I jump. Okay. Then I start rolling. And I wanna be more on the left. To get a good entry into the cutscene and not block him. This was a bad entry, okay? Steady yourself. You wanna go straight as possible and you wanna not block uh, Professor Fig. So this happened faster, right? And then get ready to roll. Once the bridge is done, you're gonna start rolling. So start rolling, get a good line. Don't get too close. I, I did get a bad line here. Um, and you want to go in front of him and try to get a roll into the stairs. If you get a roll into the stair air, you're going to be good. You don't shoot like me. Just start walking. Why would so this? <coughs> 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 Just start walking in this direction. <coughs> And don't stop. Now you're gonna get a prompt for space, and it's gonna ask you to press space while you do it. Let go of your forward key and start rolling. Why let go of your forward key? Because it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna. Um, <clears throat> wait, I'm like struggling to to breathe. Why would someone have conjured Why you like go from the W keys because you're gonna get an invisible wall. Now you wanna start pressing F, uh, your action key to like I can't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. See, you're gonna get a prompt to interact with the magic. I was too far, you see? But what you, you, you use your key. No, it's fine. I lost a bit of time, but it's a teaching now. And now get ready to roll. Do two roll and and press your your action key. And then get ready to skip. I I did like take a bit of time. Get ready to skip three cutscenes. So one, two, and three. Okay. And you wait. <coughs> then you go forward, and you want to be as straight as possible. Take the slow, the fastest path. So don't move too much. Just go straight. There you go. Okay, they're ready. They're ready to go forward. Always hold your screen key, okay? Every time, hold your sprint key. What do you suppose we should be looking for? How you wanna try to know where your mouse is? You you don't you never know, but like you wanna try to know where it is. So to to be ready to to learn Revelio. Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. Revelio, perhaps. Something here. Mm, Revelio, perhaps. Uh, let's get ready. Revelio. Yes. <coughs> charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand. Then press spam space until it lets you go forward, and then get a good entry there. Then you you Revelio. spam Revelio. You spam R to catch Revelio, right? Or you're bind, you have bind to Revelio. And then you go for it, Revelio again, and then you wait. Press F again. Start, start pressing your action key. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw in the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lumos. 
Stay close to him. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. And now you want to go southwest. So this is the way you're gonna have to go. I do. But to what end I can't So go forward until you start running. When you start running, you wanna start rolling towards the objective, right? To sprint him out. Like right now, you start roll start sprinting, I'm rolling, and I'm going towards the glow. I see something up ahead. And then I'm waiting. Waiting for him. Pressing F, my action key. Now, now I want to start pressing Revelio. It suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? This is slow time. This is a slow time, but we're fine. To have caused the floor to change. That statue. Now you start pressing Revelio. What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, go in front of the statue to be ready to cast Lumos. Now you're gonna learn Lumos, so get ready to learn Lumos. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Now try to get your mouse in the right spot. Then you cast Lumos. And now you press space. And get rid. You press space, spam space, Luma. and then one well to cast your spell, right? Space to skip the, the thing, and then one. The light. <coughs> now press Q to get ready to block. <coughs> Man, I'm sorry. I should drink water. But... Protego. Protego, there you go. Now get ready to fight. You wanna be as optimized as possible in the fight, right? You just you just don't want to miss any cast, right? There you go. Get close to him and Lumos. Now you want to face north. Stay close. You stay close. Stay close. Then you want to start running towards north. Now you get an invisible wall. You wait for the invisible wall, Professor, and then you run. Professor Fig. Run in a straight Professor, line. Where are you? Don't want to get too close to the wall. Where am I supposed to go? And then That's where they press go. your action key. Then Revelio and roll s s uh, north uh, northeast and press Lumos. Okay. It seems I have no choice. I did it slow, like because even me, I I am not doing it when I run. But they go. Then you want to attack the the one you just blocked. Right. Now get ready to press space to skip the, the tutorial. And then you want to attack the target you want. So I missed a cast there. It would have been slow. I want to attack always the, the the one I just blocked. Protego. Protego, attack the one I just blocked. Attack the one I just blocked. And finish the fight. Now you want to go east. And you just want to st sprint straight forward. And get to another ancient magic spot. Cast your press. Cast your action key again. <coughs> and then you want to roll. Start rolling. Once you see like the little boost forward. You can start sprinting. So start sprinting. There we go. Press it. Get ready to skip cinematic. One, two. I was slow on that. And four. Come. This is a bad time. I can tell because usually you want to be at thirteen fifty-five when you end the last skip. Uh, <clears throat> Something around that, right?
But because it's a practice run, we just we don't care. My time are not right right now because I don't know why, but I didn't save them. It looks like it. I'm pretty sure I saved them yesterday, but I lost them. That's whatever. Now you just wait, okay? The point is to finish, right? <clears throat> So now, uh, something I need to tell you, you, you gotta use the uh, mobile app to connect your, to choose your house, to predefine your house, okay? You can change it in the mobile app as well, uh, what, uh, World Legacy Fan Club, right? And you wanna set your house to a full puff, to skip like a dialogue, one dialogue, right? Okay. Oh, good. So now you wanna get ready to skip cinematic, okay? He's gonna... The first cinematic is when he's done with that. The first cinematic is gonna happen right there. I can skip. Okay. Second cinematic. Thank you. Third one. And fourth one. And then start scrolling. Start scrolling and pressing space. Start scrolling and pressing space. And then press F. F. To to accept your house. Skip two cinematic. And then you're done with Path to Hogwarts, right? <clears throat> Now what you want to do when you, you spawn, you want to go straight for the common room. Okay? You want to start running. Just start like just start sprinting. And you, you want to go talk to everyone in the common room. Okay, don't, just get a good line. You want to go left first. Skip the cinematic. Start scrolling and, and, and pressing space. Scrolling and pressing space. Now we're ready to leave. Go run. Go talk to this guy. Skip the cinematic. Scroll and pressing space. You do that again. Then you go talk to her. Skip cinematic. Scroll pressing space. Scroll pressing space. Now the next trick is gonna happen, right? You're gonna go see Professor Weasley. Now you scroll, okay? When you see that, you skip the cinematic. Now you skip scrolling. Now you want to hold your aim key you want, and start sprinting. Hold your aim key and start sprinting. I missed it actually. This way. But uh, if you do it I correct, give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. I should. You know what? I'm gonna do. Um, this should be all right. I'm gonna go back. Okay. Because I'm teaching, so let's redo the common room. <clears throat> we don't care about the time, right? It's just to show you guys. So you scroll, spam, space. Start running towards this guy. <laughs> Uncle, this doesn't sound like you're. Yeah. Go see Professor Weasley. Yeah. Now scroll until you see her face and hold, hold, aim and run. There we go. And then you can run. She's gonna start sprinting behind you. You wanna go right there. About. And now you want to wait right here, the closest to the stairs, and you want to start using Rivelio. Press M, continue, then continue, escape, continue, go in challenge, continue, and then escape. Then you, you want to go up. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities and outside. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker. 
your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find central. Are you wait? You open your map. Press continue. Go on your ear. Escape. Press continue. Great all. Central all on top left. And TP. But you you wanna do this fast, right? And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. Now you, you want to go straight forward as soon as you can, you right? You can get almost anywhere in the castle <coughs> from Central Hall. And my... Uh, I keep... Uh, Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Martians <coughs> cross station, so to speak. Then you want to start scrolling and pressing space. And then get ready to press F to start talking to Professor Fig. Right after that, to start talking to Professor Fig. So you press F. Continue to do your dialogue uh, scrolling and spacing. Then you wait for the thing to pop up. Alt map. You, you press two times continue. Then you right click and you escape. Okay? The map is and then you, you want to start scrolling. And then you start running. Okay? Start running towards. The objective roll into the door take the the habit okay then you want to go a bit to the right to just catch the few flame and roll into the door and go up without going too close to the wall because you get slow downs and then you want to go in your defenses against the dark art skip the cinematic learn your spell Then get ready to skip the cinematic. Right now, skip cinematic. Let's try some. Let us begin with the Then you, you just want to cast one time, one time. There you go. See how the dummy deflected your cast. Then you want to do this one levio so. Cast levio so first, then the basic cast. Remember, levio is good. I did two. That's that's no good. You because it goes faster to the ground when you do only one cast. Very now skip good. cinematic. But the best way to <coughs> if you also, I I cast it too fast. Okay. That's fine. You can do it like this as well. If you miss, yeah. then leave you also triple cast. Stop. Okay. Get ready to skip cinematic. Then scroll, scroll for skipping dialogue, and go see Sebastian. Start doing your dialogue skip, <coughs> like rolling and scrolling and uh, pressing space. You want to catch this and go, don't get too close to the wall, right? Uh, or you get slowed down like me. You don't want to go as follow, you want to go up, up these stairs, it's faster. You don't want to get slowed down like this, like I just got. It happens to me as well. And then go into the class. We get ready to skip. Get ready to learn your spell. Then you learn your spell. Then you get ready to skip. Akio. <laughs> that is not bad. There you go. Then skip again. And then here you wanna go as fast as possible and, and do all all three all three balls. So you just come your IKO here. Now think of this like Now you wanna start scrolling. Instead of throwing the marbles out because you're gonna have a dialogue. Toward you. There you go. You're gonna have the dialogue right there. You scroll, you scroll. Then you just have to wait. Just as before, and Miss <coughs> Red. Clear? Yes, sir. What's you talking 
I you just want to go uh, and do quick there you go. quick uh, accio and release I mean, that's such a good test as well. Um, and if I was actually running, that was a good one. Because I got lucky on how uh, fast she played, right? Then you wait. You don't want to block her ball. If you block her ball, you're going to be slower. So just don't block it. Do anything to not block the, the ball, right? Then you just go for the last one and get ready to skip the cinematic. So I, I... skip and air. It's a different strategy, right? We are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. You want to start on the right. This round settles it all. She depends on her. So she go this. I'm gonna go middle as well. Um. Oh man, this is good. Actually, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with that. And I'm not gonna let go because it's faster like that. Because if you do like the like we just did, right? There's a fast thing. You're gonna get hit by this, and it's gonna take what time to your ball to drop. So the only way you want to keep your ball up there is if you can hit the uh, the top of the box, so it stops you, right? <coughs> I'm gonna try to give you an example, like this one maybe. No, wait. I'm gonna I'm gonna give you an example. So right there. No, that was bad. Okay. But you want to hit the top of the box, right? So. I'm going to try to give you an example again. But you go with the timing. If you don't have the timing of the box, you just go straight for it. Like, uh, I didn't get it. Whatever. That's not too bad. Then get ready to skip. Uh, no, you cannot skip it. Very good, both of you. Well done. Get ready to scroll, actually. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Get ready to scroll. Scroll in space, right? Dialog skip. And then run through Professor Ronan. Once you're done, run through Professor Ronan. Start scrolling. Okay. And then you wait for your map to open. Once you see that, you can open your map. Click, click on Astronomy Wing and then Transfiguration Courtyard. Okay. Now we're going to have our first skip. So once you're here, once you TP, once you, you arrive, you want to roll in this direction, right? Start running, go there. And once you arrive on, on top of the circle, you want to press F okay, to, uh, to begin the quest and open your map, but right after it. So I, it's going to go like this. Open my map. And if you do that, you got the skip. And then make sure you press F before opening the map as well. And then you, you also want to go fast like this. Transfiguration for try again. This is going to be the WAC skip. You skip the Weasley after class mission, right? That's why it's called. It. Then you want to roll towards ah, Professor Ronan. Start scrolling and, and rolling. Okay. And then you want to turn around. Get the page. This is unlucky. If it does happen, like the page are bugged, and then you want to roll into the door and get this page. Roll back into the door, go back to Professor Ronan, start scrolling and spacing, 
and then get ready to learn repair off. Your wand is a conduit of your magic. Once you learn repair off, you want to go. You don't want to listen to what he says. So just roll away and start sprinting towards this door. Now you, you press continue, you release your key to go forward because you're gonna get invisible wall and then you roll into the door. And you go down, roll into the door. Then you wait, you spam F it so you can talk to Natty. Do your, your, your dialogue skip. And then you want to skip the cinematic. <coughs> and start, you're going to have a, a little uh, sprung to, to, to run. And then you want to go like this. Start rolling. Start rolling. Rolling. Then, once you arrive here, you want to go, look forward, jump, and turn your camera. Okay? Do two rows and start sprinting towards down here. The sprint starts there. Roll towards that. Sprint. And just sprint there. Then so go on the right. Touch the sheep. Keep sprinting. Then you go this way. Jump. Roll. Jump. Roll. Roll. There you go. Now you want to push in yourself about here and wait for the dialogue. Like, like when she says the the final word in the phrase, you can start going. There you go. You start going. Roll. You start running. And you want to roll here. You usually you can try to just walk it. Then you just want to go straight. If you do it correctly, you're gonna still able to sprint, and she's gonna run behind you. And then, and then you just wanna take a good. You're just gonna wanna go straight, right? <coughs> so just go straight. So you're gonna keep running behind you. I confess, I was surprised when Professor Weasley mentioned that you knew the area, since you're relatively new here. Doesn't matter if you have a good line here, because she's just running at a steady speed, right? So, now you just come here, and wait. <coughs> when the, the Nazi, Yabana Nazi disappear, you can go up. I'm getting used to things. And go see Professor... And put yourself here, and you just wait. <coughs> Hello, Mr. Moon. Have you met our new cook yet? Pleasure. Um, and you don't want to be too far. If you're too far, she's not gonna follow you. You should be doing all right. And you wanna, you you gonna want to learn the um, the last dialogue cue, right? What did Mr. Moon? To get ready to go. It's the last phrase after this one. This one. Good luck. And then start rolling. Oh, I did it too fast. Okay. I didn't wait. So you see what happened if I, you don't wait. But you just gotta get the right timing, and then you roll. You just roll. Always hold your sprint key as well, right? So you sprint between roll and not flight. Then you just want to stay as close to the wall. Just go straight. And keep rolling. I want to get to in front of Unlevander, right? Right there. Skip, skip the dialogue. You're ready to open your map and close it right away. Okay. Close it right away. Roll. Roll into the door. Press F. Skip. Okay. Press F to 
Alt F to purchase and then skip again. Then skip the dialogue with your scroll wheel and the spacebar. Now we got a bug, you're just staring at us, right? That can happen in a round. Oh, that's unlucky, but that's fine. We just move on, right? Then I roll out and start sprinting towards the next shop. I wanna roll be before the stairs, okay? Because it's gonna stop you. Now you do your rolling. Now you don't wanna go too fast over the um, the buying, okay? What we have, shall we? You wanna let them spawn. If you don't let them spawn, you're gonna get soft luck, okay? You're gonna have to do a, a little like... Um, I, I'm gonna just show you on the next one if I go too fast, what happened, okay? So, you just run. Go to the potion shop. Roll before the stairs. Welcome to J. Pippin's potion. Pardon me. Then I'm gonna show you what happens if you go too fast. What can I do for you today? You cannot buy them, right? You can do that to save the run. And it's gonna let Feel you to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Let you get them. Or come back right? another time. This so you fun. don't wanna do that. You wanna wait a little bit so they spawn. And so you can do, uh, you you, you want to get a good line as well here. Well, hello there. So here you skip the dialogue. Don't go too fast, but don't, don't go too slow as well. Let me guess. You're up to uh, there, it's fine. Escape. Plenty of ingredients. Roll towards down. this. Then you want to get this jump. Like this, I missed it. Let's redo it. Let's redo it, okay? So you want to practice the jump. The jump is really important in the run if you want to have a good time. There you go. Then you want to roll. Roll again. Go like this. Around. And go straight. Straight here. And jump here. And you want to press F. Okay. Start scrolling the dialogue. Skip the cinematic. And now you're ready for the troll fight. Just dodge as quick as possible. And just start spamming and dodging, right? Yeah. Are we weakening him at all? Keep at it! We have to wear him down! You wanna go you gonna you wanna go to place yourself where I just place myself. Now get ready to throw him stuff. So right now Throw all the stuff. You want to take the closest stuff. To beat him at his own game. Look, he spotted. I like it. Do more. And then you're done. We need to make sure he stays that way. Then you press X to invoke the ancient magic, right? You're bound to invoke ancient magic. Then start. Get ready to scroll to skip the dialogue. So scroll, 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 scroll. Now you want to repair. When you repair. Okay, you want to keep holding repair because you're gonna get some animation skip, right? Like this. You see? Lucky they didn't do more damage. Sometimes you're unlucky and you don't get it. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. There you go. Once you're done like that, you. You, you want to roll into the shop and start talking to the dialogue skip Mongolia. Don't go too fast. Plenty for your perusal today. By the Here's shop. Time. Escape, escape, escape. Press space. Click, click. Escape, 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 escape. Now start uh, scrolling for dialogue. And then, okay. You want to go out the door and wait wait here because you're gonna start sprinting faster now you want to roll Assuming it is not too roll you might even miss roll the and stop here she and then charming. go for the skip cinematic there's How two cinematic skip Good one for me. almost done I think so I now you want to open the door here wait for her to start going forward then you want to go out you want to go across the road and wait here now get ready to start your dialogue skip. Now start your dialogue skip. 
as soon as you see you can open the map you open okay you go on Hogwarts as fast as possible you you click on grade all here you can click as well here but I prefer doing it this, this way and I, I'm I'm spamming the the travel option right and this is gonna be your end time when we see the mission end uh, pop up on the screen so right about here this is where the timer ends right now there quest complete okay so this is a tutorial we got a 38 35 um that's a super bad run for me right because um i'm used to going way faster than that okay but you see oh it's not too hard to get like close to world record um and when we did a run that was like okay fast not too fast right and you, and this is what uh, for a first run it's a really really good time right if you get a, a run like this on uh, first run it's a really good time so you can just learn that um watch the video over and over again if you need to rewatch part or you can join the discord and ask for help right um if you don't understand some mechanics or things like that i still recommend you play the game like at least once uh in any difficulty you like um and uh so you get used to the mechanics of the game uh but if you just want to speed run you can also just speed run but uh, i mean might as well play the game if you're here to buy the game right um so yeah this is a beginner friendly speed run uh don't forget to join the Discord speedrunning Discord if you want to start speedrunning. We can uh, everyone can help you there. Everyone is sharing their strats. Everyone is like really friendly. So I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Bye bye.